Have fun! Try to get him up here! Come on! Come on! Yay! So, today in the post, we got our horror block. But first, if you hopefully saw at the beginning of the video on the thumbnail and the my in, my intro banner, you saw the uh, oh, nose ring. You saw the uh, the little image for will you sit down, sit down. The <laughs> image for uh, Go Figure News over at uh, Go Figure News. It is not only their their one year anniversary slash birthday over there. It is um, also September's uh, unboxing month. Um, so, um, I, I had, I had been following Go Figure News for a while, and, um, I had seen a lot of other YouTubers, uh, had been doing unboxing videos, um, for the, um, unboxing month, and, um, I just happened to come across, uh, the September... Nerd Block unboxing, um, the September Nerd Block unboxing that TJ from Go Figure News had uh, done last last week for the it was the hyperspace thing one, and I had already gotten mine, so I was watching other people doing their unboxings, and I I'm I'm subscribed to his channel, and I was watching other people doing their. Uh, Nerd block unboxings because I I've been dying to see somebody else do their uh, unboxings to see who who had gotten the the extra Star Wars item which I finally saw today and uh, unfortunately me and TJ neither one got one of those extra items boo hoo <laughs> and um, we are just in a bantering back and forth about the boxes and he had he had asked me. I have a YouTube channel that I do unboxing videos, and I was telling him, yeah, yeah, you know, I have a channel, me and one of my pups, Padfoot, you know, we do unboxing videos, and uh, he, he, he was checking out our, our channel, and he invited us to um, take part of the, the, the September um, unboxing month for Go Figure News, and I said, well, I'm still waiting for my horror blog to come in, that's the only box I have left to do. And it, it wasn't coming in until the 29th, which was yesterday, but sadly the the post office lost my horror block, so it didn't come till today. But he was like, well, it doesn't, it doesn't end until the 30th, so I'm getting it in just under the wire. So thank you, TJ, for um, welcoming, welcoming us and inviting us to take part. So we are getting in just under the wire. Um, also, um, he is doing a thing called Attack of the Subscription Boxes, I believe, and it's running until October 15th on the Go Figure News website, and you can go in there and vote on your favorite subscription boxes, ranking them from your most favorite to least favorite, um, but I will put the, the link to... Go figure news and the link to that um, attack of the the boxes subscription boxes. I'll put the link to to both things in uh, the description box below. But again, thank you TJ for inviting us to take part of um sub uh, unboxing month. So you ready to unbox our our horror block, buddy? It is heavy this month. Um, last month, Nerd Block and Horror Block was freaking epic. Um, I was disappointed that Nerd Block was a bit of a disappointment this month. Um, I've heard Horror Block is pretty good this month. I accidentally did see a couple spoilers for a couple items in the block, for Horror Block. Um, one, I can't remember what it was. The other was the shirt. Um, but as far as the shirt goes, I'm not too disappointed. Hey, got my nose ring. Hey, 
Stop licking off the floor. That's why you're sick all the time. Get over here. Right up in it. Oh, cock my finger. All right, let's show everybody. You want to look? Let's show them first, and I'll show you, okay? Let's see. So, as always, set the shirt off to the side. Start the smaller item first. Horror Faces Coasters. Now, I, I saw this image earlier, so I didn't know what this was. Um, I just saw the image, but uh, I saw this on eBay when I was some po posting some stuff to sell earlier. But Horror Face Coasters includes eight face coasters with... 16 terrifying designs. Drinking coasters to scare friends. I love these coasters. Um, a lot of the coasters you get in the nerve block boxes are like the, these cardboards that you know are going to tear up once they get wet. But there's some sealants that you can use. And I plan on, I just have to go to the Home Depot <laughs> to get some stuff to seal it with and then um, then you can make them last forever otherwise I don't want to use them but you can make them last yeah and these are like that too these are just paper that will once they get wet they'll destroy be destroyed yeah they're double sided but these are really, really cool though. I love these. Hey, but putting some of that sealant on these would, you know, make them last forever. And there's another subscription box that, and they have an Etsy store where you, um, they have like these horror tile coasters and. I didn't used to do horror ones, but I used to make like like different sorts of like different themed, you know, little tile coasters and like the little like, ceramic tiles that uh, use like for the bathroom. Um, you get them and you like just print off different designs and you make um, little coasters out of them. Very simple. I miss doing that. I should do it again. Everybody's requesting for me to do that again. Okay, now this. This I remember. Um, page 9 of last month's Remorg. Um, gave this. Uh, gave this spoiler away. It is. Um, a DVD of Night of the Living Dead. Includes never before seen. Exclusive documentary. Chronicles of the Living Dead. They won't stay dead, so, um, I don't have this on DVD anymore, so, I don't mind, uh, getting another copy, that's pretty cool, so, yay, yay, I didn't pull out a plushie right away, so he's unimpressed, so, alright, so there's a big box, and, uh, kind of figured, uh, there might be a vinyl figure, ooh, and there is... And it is a Titans figure. Ooh. Nice. So we have a, uh, it's a double. Um, and this is, this is, uh, I did see a spoiler in this. I just didn't see a spoiler, like, what it was exactly. But it's a double pack, um, of Titans vinyl figures and we got the xenomorph that is so sweet i don't know if you can see that with the so dark i can't sell from the top but not from the bottom obviously it looks like it it's been unsealed so since it's already open oh the box is crushed i hate when they do that crap you think I mean, these are collectibles, and you'd think that people would be, when they're packing these boxes, that they'd be more respectful of packing these boxes. Let's see where... 
right there, the box got like a big crushed in spot. That really ticks me off. And sometimes it's useless to complain to um, some of the subscription box services because they're like, oh, not our fault. They don't want to take responsibility for their problem, you know, their packing problem, but the figures are really super nice. A lot of people don't like the Titan figures, but I love the details on their, the faces. Everybody's all about the Funko Pops, which I love Funko Pops, but I really like Titans too. But here is the best one. So awesome. The detail on this one, period, is just so awesome. That's just freaking awesome. I'm definitely going to keep the box, but, um, oh, and it's got accessory. So, that's where it goes in the mouth. I might have to track down a second one of these to keep one in the box and another to display. Yeah, but I love this. Would have been nice if the box would have been in a better condition. I'm really upset about that, but I right, figure out how to pack that back up there. Might have <laughs> I end up having to open it from the top anyway. So all right. we got some more magnets. These are kind of like <coughs> Excuse me. Allergies are kill me. These are like the Monty Python uh, word magnets we got in a nerd block a couple months ago. Um, <clears throat> Night of the Living Dead, make your own movie quotes, fridge magnets. Which I never did take apart the Monty Pythons because I want to get a second set to open and actually use, which is like I want to do with these. But, um,. Awesome! I love these. And as always, we get our monthly reward. Some people love it, some people hate it. But I'm a huge fan. The magazine itself is always, you know, it's $10 a month for a subscription. You know, I'm a very poor girl, and I could not afford this magazine on its own. Um, I just, I, I couldn't on its own. It's just, quite, you know, not something that would be in my budget. Um, so, I definitely, definitely appreciate getting this um, in, in the horror block every month. Um, and yes, I heard that. Um, Nerdblock is introdu introducing a new block into the Nerdblock family. It is a sci-fi block. Darn you, Nerdblock! Why you want to make me poor? Even more poor. I'm already a poor girl. Stop it. Um, I, I'm not into, like, a lot of this stuff that they're listing, but, I mean, well, some of it, yeah. Uh, maybe not so much, um... Starship, Starship Troopers, or Stargate SG-1, or Battlestar Galactica, or Planet of the Apes, but Star Wars, Back to the Future, Star Trek, Terminator, Star Wars, Doctor Who, Firefly, yes, 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 I am definitely going to get the first one, because I just got to. So we've got, um, Exclusive Aliens 2-Pack. Uh, vinyl figures. Um, another glorious day in the car. Uh, this vinyl figure set depicts uh, the iconic Big Chap and Parker. One of them is having a bad day. And it's the guy with his brain showing. Um, so, yeah, that's 
I just saw the shirt, um, but I already, like I said, I already saw a spoiler for that, so I might as well go ahead and show it to you guys. And it is pretty cool. <laughs> um, they did say that there would be a Silence of the Lambs item in here, and I was kind of hoping it would be a Hannibal Lecter from the film Silence of the Lambs, not the TV series shirt. Um, which it is not, but the shirt is still really awesome. And it is this. What do you think, Bob Bobs? It is the Death's Head Moth from the film. Not quite the school. It's a little bit more prominent than it is in the actual moth. <laughs> My hair is killing me. But... That's a very, very cool shirt. I like it. So, no complaints from me there. So, awesome shirt. Awesome Titan figures. We got our room org. Love the Living Dead uh, magnets. And we got the Night of the Living Dead um, DVD. And the horror coasters so um in comparison to the nerd block earlier uh this month i absolutely loved the horror block it, it, it was it was pretty good um i can't say i'm disappointed at all it was pretty great so that that is it Headfoot's not impressed because it wasn't a plushie um I did say when I when I heard that there was going to be an alien item, I was like, and they were saying something about a, they said something about face hugging. I thought, well, if there was going to be a face hugger plush, I would not be disappointed, and I don't think that would have been either. That would have been that would have been a cool item to have though, but um, no, not at all disappointed with this block. Um, it was really really awesome. So, two thumbs up for me. I don't think any thumbs up from Patfoot, but uh, no, it was it was really good. So that is it from us. Um, go check out Go Figure News. Like I said, I'll put the links to the site um, in the description box below. Um, from us, like, comment, subscribe. We are out of here. Peace.